he's a terrific actor because he's a terrific person. I mean, he's got heart, he's got intellect, and he's just in touch with human emotions. And, and he's a great guy. I have to say, yeah, uh, I, I'm very proud, personally and professionally, to give the International Star of the Year Award to Gerard Butler. <laughs> That was the best intro ever, by the way. Thank uh, you it's true. Very much. It's true. So, the International Star of the Year, and actually for a lot of years, and also what, what we're going to do. <laughs> do you get this reaction all the time? <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, well, just before we sit down, I just want to. Um, say well firstly thank you tim that was a, an extra special introduction i was standing up there going wow really wow and my my manager was like oh it was it was lovely and it was it felt very heartfelt and and this, this is a great man here who was one of the first people to give me a big uh, kind of a big career hug when he came up to me in can and said there's something about you there's something about you, and I remember that, and it really stuck with me, and you've been a big supporter of mine. So I'm hugely honored to, I mean, I came all the way out here to, to shut up, um, <laughs> to, to um, you don't want to hear this bit, do you? You're like, yeah, whatever. Um, <laughs> thank you for all that screaming. That's really, uh, you make me feel very sexy. Hello <laughs> up there, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, no, I love you too! I love you too! <laughs> okay, now speaking of student day, now you, you were born in Glasgow, raised in Paisley? Raised in, yeah. raised in Paisley. And, and were you a good student? I mean, did you study hard? Were you... Uh... <laughs> Um, not really. No, I, I, I did spend a lot of time in school. When I studied, I did well, but I spent a lot of time. I was too busy showing off to everybody, you know, and trying to be the class clown and trying to flirt. What? What? <laughs> um, flirting with all the girls, you know, and, and trying to be top dog. And, and it, I would always get the report card, the same report card every time, which would say very bright, but if you spent less time trying to impress everybody else, then he might do better. Um, but, but then, I, you know what's really weird is when I was about 15, I remember suddenly having this one moment of clarity where I thought, wow, if I was to stick in at school now and do well, this is so boring by the way, but I said, if I was to stick in at school now and do well, I could go to university, I'd get a really nice degree, marry a beautiful woman, have a lovely family, and, and, and make a lot of money. And, and, and it actually helped me stick in at school, which I then realized was what, if I hadn't had that thought, I wouldn't have wasted seven years of my life in law. So don't always trust those feelings that you have when you're a 15 year old. <laughs> But, but when you said you studied law for, for seven years, I mean, actually, did, did, does that feed into the acting, or was it, was it really just a waste of time? It was really just a waste of time. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> no, right. no, it wasn't, actually. You know, I've I got to be honest. I, don't, I, I, I think I can honestly say that I, I, I don't have a single regret about where my life took me, that I had to do every day of that, because that was part of the development of me. Mm -hmm. And every part of me, which is um, a lot of good stuff and a hell of a lot of bad stuff, is everything that goes into my acting, even whether I'm trying or whether I'm not. It's everything mm -hmm. in the way I move, the nervous tick, the what's in my eyes. Um, and I, I, and I went through, that was a very painful period of my life, actually, because I was drinking a lot, I was very confused, I didn't know what I wanted to do with my life, but I could tell I was heading in the wrong direction. And um, so really, it, it um, yeah, so I'm just going back there in my head now. And I'm <laughs>